The video game and animation industries have experienced rapid growth in the past few decades with 120,000 people employed in 34 states, including Florida. In fact, the Entertainment Software Association found that the interactive entertainment software industry grew at an annual rate of nearly 10% from 2009 to 2012. In Miami, several companies are already engaged in industry work, including New Art Miami and Shiver Entertainment, and they are eager to find local talent. In response to this growth, Miami-Dade College is opening the doors on a brand new complex, one that will offer two new degrees for creative minds. The Cutting Edge Miami Animation and Gaming International Complex, or MAGIC, began teaching classes in the fall of 2015. Housed at the Wolfson campus in downtown Miami, MAGIC will offer two brand new associate in science degrees in computer programming and analysis, with concentrations in either animation and game art, or game development and design. First of all, the game development design, we, we see in, in, in Miami a growth in this industry. In the last five years, about 20 gaming shops opened their doors here in Miami. So we're just responding to a need from the community. And animation is because it's an essential, an essential part of the game development. And also, uh, was for the longest time, animation was just creating cartoons. And now we're seeing these, uh, this trade spilling out in other, in other industries, like healthcare, uh, advertising, broadcasting, uh, also architecture visualizations, uh, scientific visualizations, forensic animation. And that is the reason, actually, that Miami-Dade is creating these two new programs, these two uh, uh, associates in science degrees, because there's a need from the community. Students in the animation and game art concentration will learn the art of animation, storytelling, 3D modeling, and character design, all skills necessary to create an animated movie. Students wishing to focus on game development and design will learn the structure of a video game, programming, code, virtual reality, and 3D programming. So in the first year of the program, they are going to learn the core fundamentals of both trades. They're going to learn how to animate, how to model, how to program, how to create all this. In the end of the first year, every single student at Magic is going to pitch a project. They're going to pitch a project to our faculty and to our board of directors. On the second year, these kids are going to be put in groups and they're going to produce these projects and they're going to go through the whole production pipeline. They're going to go through pre-production, creating assets, and then when everything is green-lighted, they're going to go into production and then post-production together with social media, Facebook, a, a, a website, and they're going to launch the projects to the world. Knowing the whole production pipeline, he's ready to get hired by a, by a studio and just, you know, hit the ground running. In addition to this amazing hands-on curriculum, artists ready to create the incredible world they've always imagined should look no further than the state-of-the-art facilities here at MAGIC. From animation to color correction to sound engineering, MAGIC has it all, including one of the few motion capture studios on the East Coast. This is the most exciting part. MAGIC is a 9,000 square feet state-of-the-art facilities. We have here the latest technologies out there. I mean, like uh, we visited all the animation studios in the country, uh, Disney, Cartoon Network, The Third Floor, uh, Nickelodeon, Infinity Ward, Activision. We went to them all, and Magic is truly a representation of them. Like we studied how they were lay laid out, and uh, this is the best of the best in the country. There is no other facility in the east coast of the United States that resembles Magic. The equipment isn't the only thing magical about the new facilities. The complex was designed to encourage creativity, with an open lab and collaborative spaces throughout the entire area. The, we have boards all over the place. They're going to be raised daily, and we want to incentive the creative juices to flow. We have high ceilings, which allows you to breathe. That's all intentional, and it is set up as a studio because it is a studio. It is a functioning studio. It's not a classroom. Uh, atmosphere where you know it's very sterile you know white walls and, and and a computer and be creative you created a studio atmosphere for these students to come in and create their 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 work create their animation create their vision and uh, and I think that is probably the, the the best way to describe it was when you walk into magic when you go through the facilities when you walk when, you know, when you're done in here, you will have had, I think, more so the studio experience than I went to school experience. 
Phil Ferretti is a graduate of the School of Visual Arts and has worked for clients such as MTV, Curious Pictures, and Magnet Pictures. He also worked for the Walt Disney Company as a senior animation instructor for the Disney Institute in Orlando. A longtime animation instructor, he was eager to get started at Magic. As soon as I found out that they were building it, as soon as they put the key in the door, I had already sent out emails to everybody who could possibly be emailed, going, I'm here, call me up. I guess it worked. Another addition to the team at Magic will be Carlos Castellanos, an award-winning illustrator and syndicated cartoonist. An MTC alum, Castellano is the co-creator of the popular nationally syndicated comic strip, Baldo, the most widely distributed comic strip featuring a Latino family. And he's bringing his talents to Magic. I think it's an incredible opportunity, not only for, for Magic, but for the community at large, because it gives them a place to come for the, all those students that want to learn more in depth and, and, and reach that higher level of proficiency with, within the industry and really learn what's going on. It gives them access, and I think that's the most important thing. I mean, it's no longer just LA or something, you know, you're right here in Miami. I mean, I wish, I wish it was available when, when I was coming to Miami Dade, you know. One of the features that truly sets Magic apart is the mentorship program. Mentors from Walt Disney Animation, Cartoon Network, Nickelodeon, Activision, Infinity Ward, and more will be paired with students, giving advice on projects and helping them learn the trade. All the way in the back, there's a conference room, and the conference room has a, uh, it's a direct link uh, uh, out there to, uh, to video conference. And we're going to be conferencing with animators from Pixar, uh, hopefully DreamWorks, hopefully all the way around uh, as sort of mentors for our students. Yeah, I mean, it's great to be able to, to have a facility, first of all, that, that serves the community, you know, with all this incredible technology but also to make access you know, to some of the top people in the industry in various parts of the industry and bring them all here so that they can teach and mentor you know, the, the, the students here. I think it's great. The opportunities are truly endless for the students at Magic with professional mentors and faculty, industry standard equipment, and of course, the MIA Animation Conference and Festival. And Magic already has partnerships with local companies to provide internships and scholarships. We're trying to secure as many internship programs as possible so they can continue. They come over here, they learn a new profession, and then they experience the whole pipe, production pipeline. From there, they have the experience to go to a real uh, uh, studio. We're also partnering with the Idea Center. Uh, and during the second year of their program here at Magic, we're also going to provide them with entrepreneurial skills uh, because we want the students from Magic to open their businesses in Miami and to hire future magicians. The, the gaming and animation industries are industries where the biggest growth is right now. So, and, and a lot of students are going in that direction, you know, obviously. I'd say if, if it's of any interest to you at all to pursue this career, come here. The facility is state of the industry, so when the students are working on all of their, you know, uh, their games and, and their animations and uh, maybe using the green room and stuff, they'll also, you know, be at a certain level to be able to get and go and get a uh, foundation job out somewhere in one of those uh, companies. I mean, if you look at, you know, the credits on any animation or even games, I mean, it's huge, the amount of people that they employ. You know, everything from storytellers to artists and technical people. So, but there's a, an immense amount of talent and creativity involved. And this school, with the technology that it makes available to the students and to the community, just bridges that gap, helps bridge that gap for the people interested in pursuing that. For animators and game designers, Magic has all the tools you need to create the worlds and characters you can imagine. If animation or game design is your passion, look no further. For MDC In Focus, I'm Nathani Moraz.